Dude, I can hear a kid crying. Are they? What are they doing over there? Rye guy. Rye guy. What? Where are you? I'm in here. In the corn? It's cold. Hello and good morning, everyone. Good morning, everybody. It is a fall feeling day. Look at the colors we're wearing today. Very oh festive gosh. today. Speaking of fall feelings, festivities, and festiveness, what? facials. Uh, no, I actually wasn't gonna go He's there, but I can't look at you. I can't look at you. I got here. Let's do this. So, anyways, guys. I mean, I can look at you. I mean, you've been walking around with a tumor on your back, and I have to look at you. <laughs> hey, I got my stitches out today, guys. I got no more stitches. You did. No more tumor. I it wasn't hugged a tumor. him, and I was like, Ooh. He's not the tumor. She's like, This is new. There's not like a little womp. Anyways, <laughs> but you guys, unofficial kick off the fall. We have a few things to indicate. Fall, right? You got the changing of the leaves. You've got feeling of the face. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Sorry. <laughs> You've got. What a show, everybody. Uh, she's wearing it right now. You can't say that. It's a surprise. Oh, I'm sorry, everybody. Dad, beep that. Oh my gosh. Okay, uh, what else do we have? The fall festival at the kids' school. That was like That's the a good indicator. Kickoff. The cooler temps, cooler cool temps in the morning, but in the middle of the afternoon, you are like ripping off layers because you're sweating. But and then the it gets official, cool later at night. Official kickoff to what fall. What is it, Brandon? Is when we head to Corn Bell, as you oh, guys. Oh! I was being funny. I can't take you seriously, the face. Okay, so. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't even look bad. Get in here. Get in here. Just don't get it on me. Why do okay. I? Nobody loves <laughs> me in this family. You guys uh, see no, us. so the, uh, the other official <laughs> kick off the fall is when we go to Corn Bellies. If you guys aren't familiar with this, it's a very strange name. I don't really know where that came from. Corn Bellies. Not like the belly of corn. But it's our the corn maze. I know yeah. that was like a big part of it. And in fact, our relationship with them started when I got like one of the first drones ever. And I was like, I wonder what a corn maze looks like from above. And so I flew it up there and posted on Instagram. And they're like, uh, we hire like a helicopter, a pilot, and a camera crew to get that shot. How did you do that? I was like, I have this thing called a drone and I just fly it up there. Like, oh my gosh, Back it's when he was B2 Sky Sky Photography. This is a little business that I run was, on the side. It's not a big deal, guys. That was a phase. Yeah. That was when like drone video was like very rare and hard to get. Yeah. Now they sell them at Best Buy and like anybody can fly them. That didn't last long. But anyway, that introduced us to the folks at Corn Bellies. And they've been fantastic to every year supply us yes. with season passes to take They're the family. So awesome. And so we love to go and showcase how much <laughs> fun it is. We just love going. Go multiple times. Rag, I already went this weekend. Yeah, so much fun. There are so many things to do for all ages. Like you can take your little baby toddlers, like Brandon just said. Tyler went this last weekend and they it was did so like much fun as teenagers. They did like total teenage stuff, like haunted corn mazes, running around like crazy. One of the things that is really fun, and we only do this usually like maybe, eh, we do it every time. Food? The food. <laughs> the food. It's fantastic. There's so like, much variety. Food, I'm There's so food. many good things to eat. I think tonight the plan is we're gonna go there for dinner food? and some fun. Food. 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 Definitely food. food. <laughs> we're gonna get some food. Have like this elote. Ryler's already been like, mm. I'm gonna get the elote. Oh my gosh, I am literally drooling. They have little drooling. buckets of cookies. They have take lemonades. This moisture oh, and put ugh. it on your face. <laughs> but <laughs> mom does make a good point because I forget, like, we've been going here for so many years through the years that the kids have been into different things as the years have gone on because they have stuff that's literally for like two and three year olds. Yeah. Then they have stuff that's for like 10 and 12 year olds and then they got stuff for the teenagers. So a lot of stuff for everyone, but for everyone, including mom and dad, food. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what it is. Somehow we always end up here first. This is the new collar I got. Call it the Puff Love um, Jump Pillow. Pillow. Yeah. It has a name. Basically, it is an inflatable pillow trampoline type thing built into the ground. You can see, like, right there. It goes right into the ground, fills with air. Kids love to jump on it. Basically, just like a big old waterbed, fluffy trampoline. Rock guy came here the other night with his friends. Did you guys do this? Oh, you didn't do this? Did the haunted houses. Oh, okay. Well, anyways, we always start off here. Kids are having a blast on this one. Somehow, it's always our first one. The things that we like to do are the sack slide. That one's a lot of fun. Yeah. Rock guy's maybe getting a little bit too old for this stuff, or at least he's acting yeah. like it tonight. I think Tonight, mostly gonna be about the food. A little bit of fun. It's crowded tonight. A lot of people here. It's a great thing to do as a family. It's a Monday night. A lot of families out tonight having a good time. Gorgeous, beautiful fall night. You got the sun back there. A billion kids.
So weird. Holy cow, I can't stand it. It's weird. How was that? Good. The oldest person in there, that's right. <laughs> Some of our staples, some of the things that we love to do here. Apple blasters, high on that list, you load apples into an air cannon, so launch them at like various objects. I saw a busted up car over there. You're gonna explode a car. High powered apple action, so we're gonna go load up some apples, destroy some property, that's how we do. October, nothing says fall, like destroying stuff with apples. Yeah. So we're gonna go do that, one of our favorite things. Uh, I do know we wanna eat. I am completely losing my voice, yeah. you guys. This is from Lagoon. Like... When we did the fright mirrors and we were screaming on the roller coasters. Ah! Yes! It is getting worse. Bro, what is going hey, on with my voice? voice? finally cracking. Dude, I'm hitting. <laughs> finally. This is what yours looks like on a daily basis, yeah. bro. Actually, I don't feel like you ever my went voice to that. doesn't crack. It never went to that like, awkward cracking. Guys, this is bad. I'm gonna jump off this. Let's go blast some apples. Maybe the ringing sound in my ears will somehow correct my throat. Yeah. Cause that was a ton of fun at Lagoon. Thrill rides, roller coasters, haunted houses, the whole thing. Yeah. You haven't seen that. And you wanna hear why my voice sounds like this. Ah! Oh my gosh! This one's alive, but I just. Oh my gosh! Go, watch that go check out that video while well, we go blast some apples. This is embarrassing. I don't know him, I swear. <laughs> Guys, we've been blasting some apples, absolutely obliterating cars, food bats, dope. ghosts, and the like. We're done wasting food. We're done yeah. wasting apples. Now time to go eat some food. Now they've got some legendary food here. Some of our favorites include yeah. Mexican corn. Oh my. I do think we gotta get that. Lemonade, so all-time must. Gotta lemonade get a lemonade. We also have a whole bunch of new food that I've never seen before. Yeah. There's like a grilled cheese mac and cheese with pork, bacon, and mac and cheese inside. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna get. Insane. Also. Classic burgers, turkey legs, everything. Yeah. We're gonna go scope what they have, grab something to eat. And I still think there's a handful of things that we really are excited to do that we haven't uh -huh. had a chance to do. I feel like every time we come here, there's always new things, like yeah. stuff that we've never seen before. Somehow they keep expanding with new stuff. I don't know if they take up more space or if they just cram more in, but tonight is a busy, active night. The place is packed, a lot of people. So many things to do that nothing, no one thing feels very crowded. Yeah. There's yeah. so many fun things to do. This is massive. Heading over to grab some food. We maybe missed the dinner rush. It's a little after seven. Hopefully not everybody's Dang. eating right now. Let's go. This is an absolute staple. It's the Mexican corn. Sorry, my voice is still gone. But this is the Mexican corn, or elote as it's called. That's what we call it when we get it at Disneyland anyway. Absolute must have. In fact, we got three of them. I'm hoping this cures my lack of voice today. Oh, yeah. Mm. Yeah? This is next level good here. This is so good. Sorry, Raga was explaining how they do the lemonade because like I think she forgot and gave me water. He was walking me through how it's done because this is his fourth one of the season that he's had. But it's amazing. Not third, 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 third. Okay, guys, I don't know if you can even see it. These cheese curds look insane. They remind me almost of like a Popeyes chicken type breading, but on the outside of a cheese curd. I love cheese curds. What can I say? You are a cheese curd. <laughs> Our bellies are full of corn. Maybe that's where it comes from. Corn bellies. My voice is still gone. Forget it. I give up. But bellies are full. We had a ton of fun. Sun has set. It's dark. This place takes on a, a whole new chiller. vibe, whole new meaning. It becomes pure insanity. But we're not doing any of that tonight because Sorry, Danny... I gotta get back to my position inside. <laughs> yeah, I love it. I did like that. The zombie with the flesh falling off, that's amazing. But no, we are not gonna do that though, because it's like all haunted. That's what I did with his friends the other night. He came here, did the haunted house, insanity stuff. Not really appropriate for like hazy Brex. No. Not gonna do that tonight, but it is something very cool to do here, something that we would like to probably do, because it is a lot of fun. Haunted corn maze. Like you're out there in the she open in the corn. They scare you. You know what's scarier than an insane haunted corn maze? What? Having dinner without dessert. That terrifies me. We gotta go find something sweet. We gotta wrap up tonight with a sweet treat. I don't think anything can bring into my voice. Like I gave up at this point. You sound like you belong in there. <laughs> Thank you.
They really stepped up the donut shack game. That used to be like a tiny shed. It's a giant barn now. Kids are looking for some fun candies in here. Mom and I want something a little more maybe bakery-ish. They got funnel cakes, churros, or caramel apples if we want them. Of course, the candied almonds. You can never go wrong with candy pecans. Let me see what you guys got. Giant jawbreaker. It's so funny how long they have Have you these. finished the one that you got? Yeah. From the five below video. I like that it's on a stick because then you don't have to hold it with your hand. Uh -huh. That's you got like a baby so one. smart. It's smaller one. I'm down for that. If you guys want those, I'm down for that. To go through these uh, is this like not part of it? Is this like a shortcut? This is blocked off. Bro, right guy, there's a chance we might this not be able to get off. out of here, dude. Yeah, I legit don't know how we got in here at all. Shoot. Hold on a second. Uh, this is actually fairly legit. This is the corn maze that Eric did the video at where he did like the trying to escape the corn maze. What was the name of that video? He was like in there. Yeah. This is literally the maze that he was at. And ironically, yeah. guys, we were here like the next day. And so we're friends with the people here and they're like, dude, your buddy Eric was just here the other day in the corn maze, brought a helicopter and everything. Yeah. So that was pretty rad. We ended up coming the very next day. Apparently, it took him almost all day to get out. I think we're gonna have a little bit of an easier time. Got a yeah. lot of people here tonight, a lot of people wandering around the maze. I think that we're gonna be in good company. I don't know if we have to call in the chopper. We're Hopefully gonna have to call in the helicopter. Well, actually, that would be pretty safe. You do know that that is an option though. If we need yeah. to, they can land one right about right here. here. I think there's a nice landing pad for the helicopter right there if we have to. But I say we wander mm -hmm. a little bit more. See if we can get out of here on our own. Eric Let's couldn't do try. it. I think we could do it though. Do it. This is so trippy looking. In here, maybe? Dude. Since you're tall, I can actually see you across the top. Also, I think Eric did it during the day. We're so vulnerable right now. Oh! Oh! Way harder at night. How many of you are out here? Okay, we can go back. I don't know how to get out of here. Should we go the other way? Uh -huh. I legit, I can't see you. It is so dark in here. Let's go this way. Let's go this way, dude. I think I saw either a shortcut or maybe it was like, I don't know, dude. It's trippy at night, bro. Okay, I don't think that's the way, dude. Okay, hold on. Shoot. Are we going there? No. Uh, yeah. Dude, I can hear a kid crying. Are they? What are they doing over there? Right guy. Right guy! What? Where are you? I'm in here. In the corn? It's cold! Yeah, there's no way out. Oh dude, there it is. That's it, bro. We found it. We found it. We escaped the world's bro. most difficult maze, bro. Eric, comment on this video if you saw this. We beat you. I'm sorry. What do we get for escaping the world's most difficult um, maze? Ten thousand dollars. <laughs> All right. story about the whole Eric doing the video of the corn maze here. It was called like the world's most difficult maze, escape the world's... Anyways, it all actually happened and it really did happen at this corn maze yeah. and we couldn't say anything about it. We knew that it happened. Yeah. He hadn't released the video yet and I don't really know so how far in advance he shoots videos. And I was like, oh my gosh, we're going to be going through the same corn maze that Eric did a sick video and where he got literally pulled out of there by a helicopter. Somebody did. I don't remember so the video. Cool. We get to the center of the maze but we can't know where we are. Super rad. We just couldn't say anything because it hadn't come out. We didn't want to like spoil that or anything. Then it came out and we are like, oh my gosh, that is the corn maze yeah. that we were just in. We didn't come back again that season to be able to go through Cormay. So fun to get in there tonight and actually doing it at night. Pretty extra level trippy. Like yeah, that was pretty it dope. Was scary. By the moonlight and you could only see like the little tops of the corn. I love corn. But in all honesty though, we did hear from everyone who works here. He was one of the coolest guys yeah. to work with. You would never guess so that he was cool. a huge deal because he's so down to earth. He was yeah. so kind to everybody. He was so respectful of the rules, of the place. They're like yeah. honestly like a class act guy. So not surprised. Awesome, he just seems yeah. like a genuine are awesome dude. And all that just awesome. seems like a genuinely great guy. Great somebody guy. who you'd love to meet. Mm, cold. But we did get out pretty easy. Man, I don't know if I would call it the world's most difficult. Ugh, I don't know. We didn't even have the help of a helicopter. Kind of just went in and back. <laughs> yeah, no, we actually cheated. We just went in for a video and came right back out. So, anyways, guys. All right, well, that's all the time we have for today. All right, bye. <laughs>